Okay, so why are we why are we doing this? So we're doing first we're teaching no no this. The piki piki, right? What we're trying to do is be able to be used to having the stick flying in front of our face. Right? Now the stick is faster than your face ever could be. Right? And relax. I didn't say you go harder, I just said faster. Right? Okay, so then when we're starting to do this, right? Alright, so basically, when you're starting to do this, how do we start applying this? What's the most common question in Filipino Mario? Like, what if you don't have sticks, right? So let's lose the sticks. Lose the sticks. Come over here, please, so you guys can see. Jack, can you come closer? Make sure I'm so green. All right, perfect. So when we're doing this, so now the hands are going to be out here, and then we're going to use slap hands. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two. It's the exact same movement, correct? Yes, sir. So now when we're doing this, if I say move forward, right? He's still kind of doing that. Why is this? Why is this the most important movement? Nobody's gonna fight you like this, right? Nobody's gonna fight you like this. But we're just trying to, we're just, put your hands up. What we're trying to do is we're trying to show you the, the transition from the sticks to the empty hands, right? So now, here's the thing. If I start, if, if my, if I'm, um, I'm right-handed, so I'm gonna be left foot forward, right? Because the power comes from my right, from my hip, my hip rotation. So my hip rotation, correct? So now, if my hands are here, he tries to punch forward, just straight punch it to my face, that's already blocking it. Punch again straight, it's here. Here, here, here. That's, that's subconsciously, he's seeing, can you guys move over here? Move over here, please, all three of you. So I don't have to turn my neck. Um, so subconsciously, when he sees my hands are up here, he can't, he, he, there's no way to really reach my face. It's too well protected. So if my hands are up here, that means where is he going to aim for? The side. Right? So then when he punches to the, to the side, that's, isn't this the same movement as this? Where he's starting opening up? Right? Now, I'm not saying that they're always going to punch. Put your, put, put your hands back up. I'm not saying they're going to punch here all the time just because you have your hands up here, right? What I'm just saying is if he does do a straight punch, straight, straight, here, that's already protected. Straight punch, here, that's already protected, right? So then the second sequence is if you, if you give me a right hook, right, here, right? Then he gives me a left hook, here. So I'm doing the same slaps. That counts here again. So I'm doing the same slap, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So he punches with his right with a right hook here. He punches with his left hook here. Okay? So now the transition from that, he punches me with the right hook here. You notice I'm slapping hard. Right? Why? Because technically I can do this. Dead in his give him a dead arm. Doesn't always work, but why not, right? But technically, if I he punches with the right hook, slap slap, Kuban into here, right? Now I am open to, there's a lot more attack angles that I can do, right? From here, down. From here, slap his own, grab his hair, whatever, right? Again, he, he punches, he, he uses a right hook, boom, right? This is still, I'm aware of this. So even if he, let's say he throws a right hook and a left hook, boom, I'm here, ready to protect myself, right? But if you notice, right hook, left hook, I haven't let this go, right? So then you might be wondering, what, what can you do from there? So, well, there's a lot of things I can do. I can snake, right? Lock him in this way. Here, right, back up. He punches right again. Boom, 
He comes up here, boom, boom. Elbow right to, the, to his jaw. Elbow to his face, right? Let's go do this to the camera to see. So he punches right, then he goes left. I'm here, boom, into it, okay? Sure. So those are the transitions that we're doing now. Why the stick first, not the empty hands first? Because the stick moves faster than your empty hands. So if you're, now, no matter how fast your opponent is, you're used to a higher speed, right? So now, I mean, I can't say this is what happens, but it's been a couple instances where I feel like I'm in the freaking matrix. When he punches, <laughs> you know, kind of stuff, right? Punch, <laughs> that's nice. Punch again, oh, that's nice, right? I'm not saying it's like that, but it's kind of a little bit. So when he's punching, punch. You notice that I'm slap, 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 slap. Punch, boom, boom. Okay, punch on the other side. Boom, boom. Kidney shots, right? Uh